There was a new face in the St. Johnston dugout yesterday. Paul Sturrock was at Dens Park to take charge of the Saints for the first time. The players were eager to impress the new manager. And Alan Moore certainly did himself a favour when he latched onto a poor header by Gary Patterson and put St. Johnston into a 16th minute lead. 90 seconds later, Paul Mather's goal was under threat again. But Harry Curran's effort slipped past. Dundee responded in positive fashion. Billy Dodds picking up a loose ball, but firing wide of target. Dodds was more accurate with his next attempt. His header right on course, but Andy Rhodes doing well to save. Alan Moore was causing the home defence problems. His cross was met by John Davis, his effort was blocked and Tommy Turner's shot flew just wide. 1-0 to St Johnston at the interval, a good start for Paul Sturrock. But Dundee tried desperately to spoil his day. Dodds crossed and Jamie McQuillan had a go from 18 yards. But again, the ball went wide. Billy Dodds then forced a great save from Andy Rhodes. And then Dusan Verto hit the bar. As if Dundee weren't keeping Rhodes busy enough, Saints defender Gary McGuinness decided to test him too. Meanwhile, at the other end, Paul Mathers had to look sharp to save a diving header from Martin Buglioni. It cost Dundee a corner, and from the kick, Sean McCauley hit the post. Jamie McQuillan then struck his own bar, and Alan Moore's looping header was cleared off the line by Dusan Verto. 1-0 to Paul Sturrock St. Johnston.